Many people use a mobile device with a touchscreen, such as a smartphone or a PDA. Although some devices are designed to be used with a stylus, many prefer one-handed operation with their thumb. Newer devices, like the iPhone, are designed specifically for thumb use. However, operating a device with a thumb is not always easy. A key operation in many applications is selecting a target icon on the screen. Often, these targets are smaller than the user's thumb. This causes two problems. First, the thumb occludes the area around the contact point, so a user cannot see whether they have selected the correct target. Second, the size of the thumb makes selection inaccurate, often much less accurate than a stylus. Recently, a technique called Shift was invented to address these problems. Shift displays a copy of the region occluded by the thumb in a non-occluded space nearby. A user can adjust their thumb position while watching this callout. Although Shift achieves greater accuracy than normal touch selection, the user must spend additional time waiting for the callout to appear and continuing the target acquisition task. Our proposed system, Escape, achieves a faster selection time with similar accuracy. Escape works by combining finger gestures with direction indicating icons. Each icon has a pointer that we call a beak that indicates the direction in which a gesture must be made. The user starts the gesture close to the icon that they want to select. As long as each icon is far enough away from other similar icons, Escape can uniquely identify the icon that the user wants. A user can also just tap the screen to select an icon. In this case, the nearest item to the contact point is selected. Target acquisition in Escape is faster because the effective target size of each icon is much larger than the actual icon size. Escape also provides visual feedback to indicate which icon is selected, but it is easy to perform the gesture without visual feedback. We conducted a user study that compared Escape to Shift. Twelve right-handed participants used both Shift and Escape to perform a number of selection tasks with their thumbs. Our study showed that Escape and Shift performed similarly for targets 24 pixels wide, but that Escape did significantly better for smaller targets. Shift was more accurate in general, however the results were not statistically significant. We also implemented an algorithm to assign icons to target positions. The algorithm arranges icons to minimize occlusion and to maximize separation. A pilot study showed that this algorithm provides an appropriately separated arrangement in many cases. Escape allows fast selection of icon arrangements much denser than have previously been possible. There are 80 selectable items on this map. Although it is easy to see the individual icons, it is difficult to interact with them with just the thumb. But with Escape, a user can select them easily, even when they are surrounded by many other targets. We have demonstrated Escape, a target selection technique for one-handed mobile device operation. Thank you for watching.